a stat increase, bigger slow off psycho cut, and more damage after psycho cut up to three times. Also, pursuit got increased, and he was already good. Now that Absol's gotten buffed, we're going to be taking him into the top lane with a Espeon, I think? But we're going to be going, and this is the build we're going to be running. Double crit items and then a focus ban. You could run attack weight in that third slot, but I figured, hey, might as well go the focus ban for extra healing. Because if you guys didn't know, the stat increase that Absol got wasn't to damage, it was actually to lifesteal. So he has more lifesteal now than he did before. So that's going to be really big, and I think paired to focus ban, we're just going to be healing, healing a lot, right? There goes a Fennekin already. This would have been a good game for stacks, but, you know, oh, never mind, ha, huh? wow, we almost got KO'd by that Lucario. That was kind of crazy, we had to take both the berries, though. Leave some of that for our Espeon so they can evolve, hopefully. I'm already level 4, I don't know what they're doing. Ooh, they're running up, they're trying to steal some things. Trying to steal Lucario's life, I see. Uh, is Lucario gonna push up? Nope, he, he healed a little bit. Beasted, wow, what a name, man. I haven't heard that phrase in years. Oh, okay, we're not going in, gotcha, gotcha. Oh, yeah, we are, dang, Talon's here, I knew that. Look at that, guys. Easy peasy. <laughs> nice job, Talon. That was great. That was really good. But how do you guys feel about Absol so far? The Absol was already pretty good, and then he got buffed. Now he feels really, really solid. Even, like, for someone like me that doesn't know how to play Absol necessarily, feels really good. And we're going Night Slash and Cycle Cut, because I feel like those are a really good pairing together, especially after the Cycle Cut buffs. Oh. Okay, well, I did not perk Night Slash. That's kind of sad. I, I feel like that happens sometimes. I don't know why. I feel like I run straight through them and it says, nah, not today. Not today. Oh, shoot. Peace. <laughs> don't run into that. Oh, wait, he got him. Espeon's insane, which again is another thing. Espeon is like solid now. He's doing a lot of damage. Uh, Played a few games of him earlier and feels solid. How do you guys feel about the overall buffs and nerfs? <laughs> Someone's talking in the chat. Hopefully that's not too annoying inside of the a uh, video, but it'd be like that, right, guys? Uh, that's kind of funny. But, either ways, how do you feel about overall in the patch notes? Good? Bad? Meh? I feel like they're really solid and really fun. Alright, look at the Spedekin. Oh, he never stood a chance. Oh, look at that. That burst damage between Espeon and Absol combines is nutty. Oh, uh, no! Ah, we just barely missed the Night Slash. Man. But Gabite is still in our things. Is that their jungle? Gabite jungle. What a guy. Oh, dude, that burst damage is crazy. Skull Bash, don't die. Don't get taken down. Nice job. We're able to take him. I'm going to grab the bees and run on down to Dread. Maybe we take a little Fennekin if he comes a little too close. Oh, shoot. Never mind. He has a Lucario. Which, terrifying, to say the least. I don't know. Lucario really scares me. I feel like Lucario's been playing really scary. Ah. No. Oh, well, we got him. We got the Lucario. Now we're running for our lives. So we're going to go down to Dreadnought. We're almost level 7. We almost got our full build besides our ult, of course. But yeah, the reason I'm running X attack instead of Eject Button or X Speed or something along those sorts is because of our Unite move and Psycho Cut combo. Psycho Cut gives us more damage. It also slows. So if we use that and then pair it with our Unite move, it'll do more damage. And they're slow, so they can't necessarily get out of it. So I think it's a really, really good combo right now. Especially if you perk that X attack on top of it. You know, it's so good. De oh my god. <laughs> <laughs> you guys see that? That Talon just sniped that man. He straight up kidnapped him. That's hilarious. We're getting a lot of last hits. I feel kind of bad. But you know what? We'll start pushing some damage when we push into the, into the goal zone. Right, guys? Right? Hey, Talon? Jungle? Nope. Okay. Well, us three have got this 100%. I feel like you should always push this if they it's past the, you know, five minute mark. If it's not past it. Because look at that. They can't jump on us. We score for free. Easy games, right? And then look at this. We just take them all out with our Unite move. Uh, kinda. I mean, Garchomp just kinda Unite moved through it, but we had more than enough to just kinda do this. But, and now they don't have heals anymore, we can slow them, take them out, bam, bidi, bidi, bam, run for our lives, I'm dead as heck, probably. Never mind, focus ban, that's why we're running you, right? Oh no, I wanted to get the five man, so I walked in. Dang, that's rough. I got greedy, I got greedy, I will admit, but it's fine. Uh, yeah, this build's really, uh, this is really fun though, Absolutely was a lot of fun. This is my first time actually going him in lane. It feels solid, to say the least. I mean, I played him in center. I'm like, it's good, but maybe lane is the way to go, man. Woo! <laughs> there they go. And that sounds like an easy game to me. Look at that. The old 1-2 combo. I really like uh, Night Slash to Cycle Cut to Night Slash. I would have shown it off a little better there if I hit it, but I missed my Night Slash, and that is tragic. But here it is. Bam, just like that. That combo's so good. Oh, the Surrender from the other team. Actually, I might use this one. I, it's gonna be a really really short video But I think this just shows off 
how good the build is. <laughs> Got 10 KOs in five minutes, not bad. 35k damage, not a lot of damage, but we didn't even get our like unite moves like multiple times. It was a five minute match, what can we say? Since that last game was actually so short, we're gonna throw in a bonus game here with another actual top lane. We're gonna be running the exact same thing, but this one's just gonna be like a chiller game, you know? Just why not, right? I got what I wanted to say out there already, so we'll just play a game of ranked absolute top lane, right? In short, I was having fun and I wanted to play another game of Absol. Well, I mean, I guess we got the Corefish really fast, but I feel like that. I think they got that, but we might be able to get the slow bro. He probably has too many heals for us to deal with. Oh no, our slash just came back. Tragic. But we'll faint away. Fight some Apoms and just kind of vibe this game. Let's try to get our Min Min, our Sylveon, level four here. I don't really need anything to level five. So I'll guard the base. I'll guard from uh, this one. Oh my gosh, he got that. How did he score that? I was hitting him. Hello. He does a lot of tankiness. Uh, that's not the right words for that at all, but there he goes. Oh, I wanted to get him, but I'm kind of scared. No, oh, never mind. They're absolutely down, I think. And that's their jungler, so we should be fine. So just over push here. Or at least get our bees on time, I guess is the right thing. Keep the pressure on, he says. Okay, I'll try to bait them out while I fight the bees. You take a- Yeah, yeah. There we go. Okay, I didn't get many of the bees, but I did beat up a Froki a little bit. And honestly, that's just as fun to me. Mm, all right, let's take out the Slowbro again. Why not? Uh, honestly, hindering a Slowbro is really good. He's super good right now. If you guys haven't seen the Skullbro right now, apparently with the newest patch, Skullbro was actually, uh, he was bugged for a while. His Skull only burnt like two times out of five. So it's kind of crazy right now. Uh, now that it burns its full five times, it's doing a lot of damage, you know? So if you see a Slowbro in your games getting like 80k damage, that's why. But hopefully, oh no, he's going to surf. Never mind. Forget everything I just said. I'm not scared of this man's anymore. I'll beat him up for free. I'm not going to push too hard though because there's uh, a few of them there. If this Froki comes after you, he's done zoed. Okay, there we go. Not bad. Bees, bees, bees. Don't spawn for another 25 seconds. I don't know what I'm doing waiting here. Jumping a slow bro again. That sounds Okay, I missed my night slash yet again. Tragic. Uh, do I have, I have focus ban, so I actually, I'm good to push this. <laughs> nice. I was like, I was looking at my health. I was looking at the bottom right. I'm like, what build am I going? I'm like, yeah, I'm, I'm building focus ban. And that's exactly why I go. Because I could be extra risky for no reason at all. Down here for a little bit. I should be getting these core fishes, but I'm just going to run. I'm just going to run, run, run. Because my man's getting jump, jump, jumped. But we save him. And we're good to go. All right, uh, that was a pretty good gank. We took out one of their tanks yet again. Slowbro's just not having it this game. We are picking on him hard. Oh, there's a Snorlax. That's cool. Uh, Snorlax also got a little buff too. Oh, okay. Running for my life. Oh, we can flip this. Yeah, I guess this is fine. Duralid on this way too much damage. There we go. Ooh, -hoo. and then I love seeing the life steal on Absol now too, though. It's actually really nice. If you hit like a clump of people, you can get so much health back. Let's get our scores and run up to run. Did I already score that? Wow. Wow. We scored instantaneously because our entire team was on it. That's what I love to see a good team vibing right again this build's feeling really nice i actually like it more in the top lane than i do in the center lane which is kind of good i think all right there we are i think i messed up my combo a little bit but it works is he going score shield is that why i couldn't stop him earlier or am i just crazy all right well they're absolutely oh no that they're absolutely still alive i thought he died but it was just his unite move making him invincible i was like huh interesting oh he's back and up. We need to continue taking this. Th yep, there's that boy right there. A little scary. Can we break it before the th Rodom shows up? Uh, it does not look like it. Can I at least get a Unite move out? There we go. Bam, that's two for us. And I got that before we all broke it. I would push, but I only got 13 points. And if no one else does, why not? Right? Why not not? If that makes any sense. You know, I'm going to stop talking. Oh, Greninja ulted. What the? Why? Uh, I mean, I guess they really wanted Cinder dead, huh? Alright, uh, that's a little sad for our Cinderace. He got bullied. Dragonite going in in. I'm gonna, I'm gonna sweep up with him. Oh, I got snapback! I got snapback! Alright, we run it out, I guess. Uh, I was gonna help him out. Oh, no. Oh, no, no, no. What's happening to our boy? What's happening to him? Uh, he died too soon. Alright, that, that's a double sweep up. Can we get a triple? And, oh my gosh. Oh my gosh, how much I missed my night slash. But that's a third... And that's a fourth. We take all four of them, ladies and gentlemen. Can we take out the Absol too? Oh, never mind. I missed my ability, so I'm probably gonna die. Oh, yep. <laughs> that's so sad. I was like, I don't think I could take him. The moment I saw him Unite moved up and just cracked, I was like, I want the Penta again. But again, I got greedy and got KO'd. Seems to be a theme. 
Okay, I'm gonna swatch for like 0.5 seconds. Realize we can't get there in time and go to the top. Uh, maybe Dread could get that. Nope, slow, bro <laughs> slow bro secure. Oh, Surf, that makes sense. Surf secures. But now we're gonna get road on. What? We have a surrender road out despite us heavily being in the lead. Man, I wish those people just got banned immediately. But, you know, like on, on, on the spot. I don't even care it would be a 4v5. I hope they just like got kicked out of the game instantaneously. They're gonna destroy our bottom zone. Nope, we got people defending, and then we can push this one. I can use one more Unite move before the fight. Um, scary, to say the least. Boom! No, what? There's no way! Alright, sque sweep up, crew. There you go, Cinder. Uh, Roto might be able to help. There, nice job, guys. Nice job. My Unite move got murdered. <laughs> I don't know what happened. I came out of it. I used uh, a Night Slash. I bulldozed through them, got a lot of health back, and then they just said, no, you're still dead. I'm like, okay. That makes sense. They did have a very scary t Oh my lord. Okay, well, we did good damage to him, but we cannot finish him. Oh, shoot. Uh, speaking of not being able to finish him, he's back. Let's see if we can actually take him out here. Why are they fighting this? So why are they risking their life for that B? I mean, that thanks. That'll give me my Unite move back on time now. That's cool. <laughs> we're spinning. We're spinning. Nice, nice. All right. Uh, our Dragonite's getting bullied. <laughs> okay, they all Unite moved. We kind of need to survive this. Um, dang, they are, oh my god, they all popped Unite moves. This is tragic. I'm gonna grab a berry, actually, big brain. I'm being pushed out by their slow bro, so I hope you guys aren't doing too bad. Let's check how they're doing. Uh, our slow bro just healed back to full health. What am I supposed to do here? I think I could take him out. Alright, yeah, I don't know why he tried to 1v1 me for so long, but we take him out, we got our Unite move back because of that. Our team's doing really solid down here as well. See, we outlived their Unite moves initially, and that just, like, let us practically win the game here, I'm pretty sure. I got a Unite move up. We got a lot of flipping potential. Oh, shoot. Ah, uh, did I miss? Oh, my gosh. Oh, no way. No way. Okay, we killed the one. Okay, we have a surrender vote up instantaneously. Uh, there's a high potential. None of them even score. Uh, if you guys could stop that Machamp, it's a really high potential. We actually don't need a score. We just need to survive. Let's slow him so we can't get here in time. Yeah, we should be fine. Just defend our goal zone, and we're more than good. Uh, Slowbro's gonna score like 100, but we have a huge lead, so we should still be fine. As long as they don't score anything else, we're still in the lead, most likely. Uh oh, uh-oh. Wait, wait, ah, he has score shield! Why does Machamp have score shield with 10 points? There's nothing I could have done. Actually, nothing I could have done. Shoot, we, have, we might have to counter score. Ah, uh, that's anyone's game still. It's anyone's game. Uh, no, we should, we should still be in the lead. Alright, well, that's a team wipe. Nothing we could do about it, though. That's terrifying. That was an extra 20 points that we did not need scored on us right there. That Why did Machamp have Score Shield? Score Shield is one of the worst items in the game. Yet, yeah, like, I've seen so many people running it. I don't understand it. But, I uh, could win games. Ah, oh, okay, nah. Not even close. Easy games, easy games. What can I say? Ooh, alright. Sylvia so with the MVP. Let's go ahead and like our team. We, uh, try. Actually, I shouldn't have liked our team because they try to forfeit so much. But that is all for the second game. We got 14 KOs, 98k damage. Not too bad at all. Uh, pretty solid. We almost broke 100. Nothing crazy, though. Because I feel like, again, this build could do up to, like, 120 pretty easily. It's kind of nutty. Especially if you want, like, attack weight instead of focus, if you're just going full damage. Let me know how you feel about Absol and the current buff and nerfs that have happened in the game recently. And that'll be all for this time, guys. Like and subscribe if you're new here, and bubble out.